What is this? Okay, good. It looks like I just milked nothing. I should probably not do that in town. Just like jack off in the town square. Hey, how's it going? Whoa, whoa! What the fuck is this? <laughs> Got him! I've just been drifting around, being led by circumstances. No, that's not right. And I'll that you helped Bart when he needed it. You can't give a fucking straight face this awful writing. Drifting, kind of like me. Holy shit. <laughs> Quite dead yet. Don't worry though, I have a telescope equipped. Uh, the sprite tells me it's a lady, but the face tells me it's a man. Do that Dr. Girlfriend voice. Yesterday my stove caught on fire. I thought the whole house was gonna burn down. You, they're ugly kid. Every kid is ugly. What the? These aren't special in any way. There goes the potion! Oh! It's a perfect fit. Oh! Ooh! Well, that's gonna be a problem. 24 people have died. <laughs> we might not finish the campaign now. Oops. I never equipped the chainsaw. I never equipped the chainsaw. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I didn't stab that man with a chainsaw. I just made chainsaw noises as I hit him with an axe. <laughs> Holy fuck, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I know I heard oh, he'll have the key for sure. Police, nobody move. Like I kicked his his knee bone or something. Are you oh, blind? Oof. What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Armor broken, what the fuck? I just kicked that boar and my clothes exploded. Arcanum. Damn it. Stop! You totally fucked it up! Well, you fucked me, dog. We're not getting in now. You blew it, old man! Holy shit, you blew it! Wow, it's just his face! Yes. I can't take you seriously when your planet's called Choco. Welcome to Choco. Keep your nose clean. Is your planet named after candy? Spell shit in hindsight. That went pretty good. What the hell is this? It says the sacrifice of fire is the gate to ruin. Place torch if you crave the void. Okay. Uh, I fucked that up. A whole bunch. Hey there, we're at the... I think the end. 
And we might need to make some very serious choices today if we're at the end. We might need to completely give up on faith, because I I didn't really lean into a faith strength build. I forget to use incantations a lot, and the incantations I do use, I don't like. They're not very powerful. Well, we have 28 faith. Earlier when we had like 40 faith, I was still underwhelmed with a lot of them, but I think it's also to say goodbye. It's time to the fat man. Meatball of Justice was having a lot of trouble. Man, e even in this, I'm still heavy. That sucks. I was hoping by ditching the fat guy armor, we'd be light again, but no. What if we do this? Son of a bitch. That's unfortunate. We're still heavy. Because I think the problem is, is my, my mimic inherits that heaviness. Well, shit, never mind then. Which was this? Remembrance of the Black Blade. We should see who, but, oh, that's Malekith or Makalith. Fucking Mr. Anime. New items can be purchased from the Twin Maiden Husks. That's weird that they would say that. Is the fire getting worse? I do have some bell bearings I forgot to give you. We can go all the way up to eight. All the way up to eight. Holy shit. So that means except for Max. We can take a weapon all the way. What's this? A bewitching branch. Sure. Got some spells I've never seen before either. What the fuck? Increases physical negation. A black flame incantation of the godskin apostle. Summons black fire with an increasing physical negation. However, sacred flasks and other forms of HP restoration are impaired. Oh. What is this? Retaliates upon receiving a number of blows. That's weird. Greatly increases holy damage negation. See, I don't think holy damage comes up enough for that to be its own thing, but... Yeah, barely found any flowers, but... Found a lot of smithing stones, apparently. Which is good, because I wanted to try that Blasphemy Blade, if necessary. I mean, to be fair, I think the reason we're fat is this guy. Yeah, that gets us down to medium instantly. Gets us down to medium with room to spare, too. This guy's actually lighter. Now, can we tempt fate and go back to Meatball of Justice? We cannot. I can't tell if the fire's getting worse. I want that blasphemy blade, which might warn a respec, which I'd probably just peel it off of endurance at this point, because we never quite got to a medium load with the meatball armor. Uh-oh. Heat stroke got her, I guess. His black blade. Malakats. Black blade, which was once harbored the power of the Rune of Death, a sad shadow of its former glory. How fucking convenient. After a fragment of death was stolen on that fateful night, Malekith bound the blade within his own flesh, such that none might ever rob death again. Unique skill set free the remnants of destined death, plunging the greatsword into the ground to summon a myriad of blades. In addition to dealing immediate damage, this attack reduces an enemy's maximum HP and continues to wear down the HP for a short time. That's dude was fucking me with it. It was a weapon art that doesn't exist anywhere else. I thought it was doing black flame to me or something, but... That might also explain why, uh, like, I've seen people do that on, like, uh, Fire Giant sometimes. That weird great chunk appears. Caster creates an illusory black blade, then leaps forward to deliver a spinning slash that emits a wave of light. This can be followed up with one additional attack. That also fucks with their max HP. This is faith. It's like right at the end of the game, you get a faith spell. I want the equipment. 
Uh oh. I want this. There you are. Blasphemous blade. We need 15 dax. Um. Kind of tempted to do a little co op. Like an idiot. For that three decks instead of respecking. We can explore the study hall. I have no faith in that. What's this? Blasphemous blade was weapon of tide. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, yeah. probably one of the things that soured me on this playthrough was uh, my refusal to adapt my build. I also really regret playing this game blind. It's very similar to uh, Bloodborne, because my very first time I played Bloodborne, I did not like it. But then when I played it again, uh, which was the stream, the stream was my second Bloodborne playthrough. The second stream was more enjoyable. But this first Elden Ring playthrough has been kind of forgettable, honestly. Trying to play it blind. Not changing my build, never looking things up. Well, I look up a boss after I kill it. I've seen some wacky shit. I saw the wackiest fucking thing, actually, while we have ADD. Is apparently you can jump over attacks. And I saw a guy do it to Crucible Knight. And I know for a fact there's a Crucible Knight here in Stormvale. Man, I never fucking opened it. One of life's mysteries in the lands between. Where's the elevator? It's right here. Yeah, this guy was fighting the Crucible Knight. I think it was the one at Stormvale Castle. And uh, he played too much Elden Ring. He was showing off. Apparently, if you're falling to your death, you can repost someone. And uh, that'll put you in a, a blocking animation so you won't take fall damage. So that's what he did. He, he he pushed the Crucible Knight like off the roof of Stormvale Castle, and then right before they both hit the ground, he reposted it. It was fucking disgusting. I'm going to say it was Rampart Tower. But yeah, I would, I would have liked to go all the way with the Giant Crusher, but... It's also my first Colossal Weapon run. I've never done Colossal Weapon character before. And it's slow, but I'm kind of underwhelmed by the damage, frankly. Things got really spongy after uh, the Erd Tree. I have not been here in forever. I can't remember. I can't remember the damn bonfire I need to go to. The sad thing is the Crucible might still might get us. No, it's not this one either. It's going to be embarrassing if these guys get me, but... Do you fucking mind? It was the one by the birds. Which was the damn bird bonfire? Was it Rampart Tower? Or, sorry. I want to say it was lift side, then take the lift up, but that felt wrong. Try cliff side. I also feel if we decide to go to the Blasphemous Blade at the end and commit blasphemy against the Giant Crusher, this is definitely not the right fucking bonfire. I am so lost. That's the median lost alarm. What is that? Have I been there? That doesn't feel like I've ever been there. I have never been there. There's a lot of things we missed. Like, we're not doing this. Getting hit by that Molotov, but I meant something else. Can't open the map right now. Uh, 
Like this whole thing apparently must be like weird hidden tough kid shit we missed. We're not gonna bother with that. I'm at I'm at peak challenge on this build. And I just wanna get out of here. How can I not find this fucking crucible knight though? Because you were like on the wall and then you would jump down. And there was a crucible night there. I think it was the first crucible night we ever met. Medallion of the Hallig Tree. Well, see, the thing is, we've only found one. We've only found one part of the, the Hallig Tree. Nope. Shit. I really don't want to go there and get the shit kicked out of me. I was really banking on not having both halves. I got my own fucking problems, like being lost in Stormvale Castle because it's been 50 hours. I can't summon here? Is it already deployed? Man, where the fuck? I was stuck on that particular bonfire for so long. How can I not find it? Maybe I take the elevator here in the Rampart Tower. No, wait. Okay, this is it. How did I not notice this before? Um... That's how we drink. It's been a couple days. No fucking way. The threads are already on their way, young man. Yeah, maybe if I had way more mind, but I feel as a strength faith character, my stats were spread too thin. There was a way to drop down and get the shit kicked out of you by a crucible. Here. I don't have a lot of faith in that bloodstain, but I remember doing it. Because he's way down there being a little shitlord. And then I think we, like, land in a bush. Uh, no, that doesn't feel right. just treasure? Didn't expect here again. I gotta get down there somehow. Oh. No, that also feels like it'll kill me. What am I doing? Didn't expect good fortune. <laughs> That's not how bushes work. Alright, now you can parry a crucible knight, but this is not a parrying shield. We're going to see if I'm fucking strong enough to fight the first Crucible Knight in the game. We can also try to jump. I don't have high faith in the jump. I only have 28 faith in it. Okay, he's a baby. You love to see it. That's the one you jump. Alright, we'll never know. 
horns. What was Homeboy Garden? Okay, that's where that takes us. Well, can I put my fucking thing down? Why can I not send summon today? I don't think there was anything else we left unattended that I'm aware of. Like, obviously, this, and uh, there was a bunch of stuff down in Caleb. There was nothing that was like, oh, like, I'm determined to do this part of Elden Ring. We could do that little PvP arena, I guess. Where we fight the NPCs. We might be strong enough to brute force them now. I have death root for you, I think. Here you go. I think I killed you in a time paradox. I won't forget. Again. My appetite. My sin. I must consume more. Beast Claw Great Hammer. What's this, the path I have? Oh, right, yeah, apparently, after you killed that spaceman, I was supposed to keep going. And I just left. Because normally, uh, like in a lot of the other ones, like when you do, it's like, oh, it's a fucking big boy. Uh, it's usually just a dead end, and then you leave. I guess that's like a more of a Dark Souls 1 thing. I cannot proceed without a ring of oath. Well, there you go. What terrible advice are you giving me now? I can finish killing Magic Dragon? Oh, the one that was outside Rainy's Tower that flew off. Um, but yeah, we have a lot of quests half done, so I'm not surprised we're going to be locked out of some stuff short of doing a bunch of wikiing and running around. But like I said, I'd prefer to just get out of here. I'll probably finish off all the achievements in my personal time, but... I've been frustrated enough that there's no need to play for another 50 hours. I was just in a bunch of no-no spots, apparently. Let's see if anyone needs my help. Being some another world. Oh right, study hall. We were about to do study hall. Who am I helping? This better not be the fucking that magma dragon when you go up the cliff. It's so weird to see high level people do that. Gelmir's hero grave, sure. Um, yeah, you know, even if it's one with a watchdog, what's wrong with your fucking head? Oh, that's the uh, that's from uh, Bubble Boy in Lindell. Oh no, I don't do this one. Don't fucking summon people to chariot one, my man. <laughs> that's one way to return to my world.
Yeah, the chariot dungeons are okay, but I would I would say that's the the one part of the game that doesn't warrant. So actually, I would prefer to do all of the catacomb slash graves solo and then just summon for the boss. Like summon for the boss, whatever. But I generally didn't mind going through the zones and shit solo. And then there's a couple I don't mind doing. Uh, Shaded Castle is one I really like to do, but I always get jumped by a bloody finger when I help people. Where's this fucking insane elevator that I never found? Where would it even be? Like down in the sewers? Oh no, it's Deep Root Depths, isn't it? I think I read that I missed a quest or two down in Deep Root. Excuse me, I'm being summoned. Oh, speaking of Deep Root Depths. Oh shit, are we on the spooky part? Why would you fucking summon me in the Afraid of Heights part of Deep Root Depths, you piece of shit, Morgan? Don't want the giant hammer in my way. recognize some of these spell sounds. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't know what it is with fucking Japanese people and climbing on tree roots. But it seems to come up a lot. This is where I got fucked. With all the ants piled up on us. Is this the... Yeah, this is after you get the three fingers. You go deeper down into the deep root depths and you climb down. This just puts us at the uh, the gargoyle entrance of deep root depths, but... Yeah, I don't like fucking height puzzles, so... Is he coming? Man, why would he be here? Well, guess you can't get too fucking fancy in a straight hallway with no walls. That was weird that it let a whoa. That's the way to go. Okay, we're on some moderately solid ground now. That's good. No more clenching for us.
Yeah, there's the casket. Okay. Yeah, I would say after finding and doing the whole sewers and then that tree thing, I, I would I'd rather just fight the fucking gargoyles. Put on a great shield and fight the gargoyles. If we're lucky, Blue Cat here might show us what the hell you're supposed to do down here in Deep Root Depths, and then we'll just steal that information for our own version. Yeah, we need three, so probably close to 400,000 souls to get the three levels in Dexter of the Blasphemous play. And then, like I said, we could just peel those levels out of Endurance on a respec, but... A triple shot bow, and then he's just got like eight daggers floating around him. Man, the world of a wizard. I was thinking about doing a wizard in my Demon Souls remake playthrough, which is gonna feel awful after the quality of life in Elden Ring. But on the topic of a game being more fun on your second time through as I do know my way around Demon Souls. I would just plan out the wizard build, make sure I get the right spells. I forget what I was in Demon Souls. I think I was Faith Moonlight Greatsword. After you. So oh Christ, it keeps going. See, I swore I came in here when I was me, like the host, and I don't think there was anything in here, so I don't know why you would come this way. Unless I'm misremembering, I've just only been in here as a son. Incredible spell. Yeah, maybe you just gotta go all in on those stats when you're a wizard. You can also do shit like, uh, I'm just leaving these guys to their own devices. Um, these hats. Yeah, FP's cheaper. I feel those are always like the no fucking around wizard you bump into when you get summoned. Could this guy stop fucking showing off? Please tell me that's part of the spell animation. I'll just... mine gives me enough. So we're a little shy. I think we have like 16. Maybe even less. 13. Yeah, we have some very bare minimum stats. Whoop. Did we lose that homeboy? He's fine. Yeah, because what are we? We're very high level. 141. 
Like, I mean, you could just keep going, but I feel I've played a lot of Elden Ring. Another fucking invasion? Good lord. We gotta get to solid ground. I'm not fucking fighting on these branches again. I'm gonna get PTSD. Perched on a tree stress syndrome. Well, the D's disorder, I suppose. Hopefully we can give this invader the D. Man, save some FP for the invader, homie. I'm assuming also once you're... Once you have a lot of mine and do a lot of damage, it's worth it to have like three or four blue flasks on your hotbar. This girl, though, she's just having the escort of her life. I'm here, uh, but mostly the super wizard. Oh, he found him. That guy was not built for fighting wizards. This wizard's gonna sleep like a fucking you bitch. Don't fucking emote when you kill him. That's just, oh God. That's just fucking rude. Sir, you just got fucked, teehee. I'm sure the wizard can beat the shit out of him, too. Yeah, I don't know what you do down here besides fight that Crucible Knight, so maybe this guy will show us. I have a feeling I was maybe supposed to climb up some more trees. Guy's got a fucking spell for every season. Where are we going, blue cat? Did I fight boss atop of roots? I have no idea what that means, so no. Little spell also staggers it so it doesn't just burp in his face. God damn it, I hate wizards. They got it so easy. Don't worry, when I play a wizard demon souls, I'll be like, I fucking hate melee. They got it so easy. that guard counter for a very long time. I don't think I got that one down too. 
Although I don't think, it, I think it's just always weird shit in those. I don't think that helps me if I get the one in my world. Yeah, that one there was just a crucible night. We fought him, but if there's like a boss up there, we didn't do that. Jump, homie. We just like clobbering basilisks for fun. What are we up to here, blue cat? Yeah, hope the host is doing okay because I'm just following you. If we go for the Crucible Knight, he's going to get the shit kicked out of him. Because I can block a Crucible Knight for Mr. Wizard here. God, how does he have fucking spells I haven't seen before? He's got big laser beam. I think he's got like the gravity meteors from Radon, I guess. He just killed all of them. He just killed all those guys. Fucking wizards. Peeled them like a banana, left the clothes behind. God damn it. I don't think this is even safe to do when you're not on a horse, so you can come back for that yourself. I helped. I didn't help at all. He was dead. This is fucking absurd, this little man. A third invasion. Holy shit. Immediately cast his butt fucking spell. Where are you, you nerd? I did like the terrible strategy we invented last time of just running at them with our shield up and hoping everyone else kills them. Playing like a retard really throws him off. There he is! Isn't he the first one that we got? Blood res? He's gonna try and run into some bad guys, I'm sure. I have a lot of endurance. He's got some sort of weird tribe. Bunch of bleed. That's what was fucking us in a volcano manor. You're tough, but you're not whatever this wizard's up to tough. Oh, no, you don't. I'm about to stand it now. I'm going to try to cast it again because I can get to it. Good enough. Oh, you might be running out of stamina. He's gonna try to make the mausoleum step on. Damn. Oh, went out with a bang. I can respect that. Except the part we ran for 45 seconds. Don't. We've already. Okay, I don't even know what the fuck you're doing. Like, we were not a part of that fight, young lady. Oh, right. I'm amazed this guy still has war crime spells left.
And when he gets slow on FP, he just starts fishing out backstabs. This guy should be on the fucking box. Who's on the box for Elden Ring? I think it might just be the titular Elden Ring. I'm allowed to kill people too. Like it just turns around, can be a little squirt. All right, let's fucking beat this guy up. Where is he? How's this open? Did you? They already did the bottom part, and they summoned us for the roots part. Who the hell is left to fight then? Hopefully they go to boss up top, you and me both. Yeah, we were up here, and I think we got tricked by that guy. We were just looking for treasure. Or maybe over there. I'm going to go die to these guys. So that I don't know where the boss is. See you later! We're not gonna know where the boss is again. Fuck! Probably the most exciting part of that whole adventure is me getting knocked off the roof. I can go up there on my own, yeah. That's just twice I died up there to those guys. I'll just go check it out myself. Oh, holy fuck. <laughs> I got oh, we were in that summon for so long, I forgot that guy was beating the shit out of me. He scared the fuck out of me. Okay, Deep Root Depths. Actually, I think the name of Eternal City is closer. <laughs> holy fuck. It's like he jumped out of the game into my headphones and scared me. Let's get one level index. And we're not going to summon our Mimic because when we inevitably get summoned to someone's world, we lose the ability to summon our Mimic world.
Ooh. I'm not even sure if there's a way to safely do this because I feel the perfume guys really stagger their attacks. Remember, it's I think it's Gelmir's Hero Grave is the the chariot one we've refused to help with. Hey, Shaded Castle, we were just talking about this place. We're just talking about how we make good time and then a bloody finger always beats the shit out of us. Really shit out today too. Normally it doesn't rain at least. We're helping Izanagi with the assistance of Wee. What do you got there? Got a wacky little sword. Oh man, you're normally not right by the fucking Look at that. That's the hard there it is. It's always a fucking bloody finger in this place. And I'm never near the host when it happens. Maybe there's a shortcut there I don't know about, but. Where are they? You know, I don't even know how to get back up there to help them. I'll just go on ahead and get soloed by the finger. Yeah, something about Shaded Castle. down in the swamp. Oh, well, well, why did you leave the host unattended? I'm a piece of shit, that's my excuse. Get the fuck out of here. That Bobby a couple seconds. Well, don't you go in, you're the host. Is he just, yeah, he's just gonna book it into worse enemies. I need my shield. Oh, apparently, staggers me out of my guard break. Man! Now it's fine that the twin blade keeps hitting. I don't like the fact that it staggers. I do have lighter armor. Oh fuck, I was in the middle of getting hosed. I got a decent window to book it. I'll wait till I get by it. Oh no, sorry, I that's the easy one. This is the one I was on. 
Whoa, hey there. Oh, fuck, that's not good. Um, is this where I want to be? Maybe. Huh? This might be different. It's higher, son of a bitch. Don't you fucking knock me off. I know you're gonna. You little shit. How do I get down from here? We're walking from now on. There's a grace there. Really wish I grabbed it. There is a 5% chance I could pull that off with the horse. Hundred percent chance I can pull that off with the horse. Coffin required ahead, that's a good sign. Are you ready? No. Some sort of tree dragon. Well, this feels like a two phaser if it's just some weeb. Oh, yeah. the Japanese part. Watch out for those, holy fuck. How fucking dare you circle back around. The meatball of justice himself. My mimic had a real shit go on that way. I was expecting, uh, like, a Japanese dragon or something. Oh, the lady's there. Well, a lady. I don't know who that is. Memorize spell. What is Fia's Mist? 
It is sorcery. Oh, that's the death fart. Hello? Ah, uh, there you are. I knew you would come. Oh, that's a lady that always wants to get the second base in her bedroom. To deny us and our ways, like the dogmatic brutes of the Golden Order. You are an odd one. I am the guardian of those who live in death. They call me a foul and rotten witch. Yet you still wish to be held by me? Talk in secret. Don't want anyone else to know. All these people. Have you ever seen a hollow brand? When the first of the demigods died, his flesh was marked with the half-wheel wound of the centipede. Godwin's hollow brand has since been recovered at the Round Table Hold. But there is another hollow brand out there somewhere, and I must find it before the time comes we receive our Lord. When Godwin died, but another exists, and I must before the to my hands, will you still let me? Pull this giant hammer out of my pocket. I think I'm out of portal keys. First off, victory. Be wary of strong foe. I guess my Mimic tier is strong. Maybe you can get here before Mimic 10 or whatever and then have a rough go of it. Prince of Death. I just can't summon in the study hall. That kind of complicates my desire to explore the study hall. This fucking part does not like my PlayStation. I did, but yeah, I just I'm not allowed to summon in there, and I don't want to. I want to get some free runes doing co-op, so I'm not going to explore any areas that kill my sign. No, <laughs> this place is fucking huge. Why can't people just summon at the boss like civilized humans? Hunter Paul. That means that we've been invaded. Man, you are so fucked. 
terrible at PvP. No, oh, after you, my mistake. You know, just wanted to do a couple Radon fights. Maybe died a fire giant 20 times today. Stuff like that. Not deep, not all of deep root depths. Ugh. I don't even mind deep root depths. It's just, just a generic zone. You're getting the express tour, my man. No blue cat wizard for you. I guess I could fuck around in deeper depths myself, farm out some runes. The thing is, too, it's going to be pretty expensive to get that Blasphemous Blade up to 24. Can't go this way. Shit. I ran away from you on purpose. Um, I guess. I feel somber stones are just more expensive. And I'm fairly confident we have a plus 10 somber stones. We can get Blasphemous Blade all the way maxed. But I can't think of another boss weapon that interests me. I always got some sort of a glaive. A fellow member of the Great Shield Gang. I use mine in memory of my Spirit Ash, the Great Shield Gang. Well, that, and it was the only way I could beat gargoyles. By the power of the moon, it would punish you. It was a long enough range. Wait, 
right, guys. They can't fucking wait to give me death. Hello? Huh. Must have jumped off a cliff because he couldn't find us? That would explain what the hunter was doing here when I was summoned. This is where I jumped down earlier. This is not the way to go. I think I have to buy this guy. I think you said the magic dragon was hiding here somewhere in the lake. Or like up on the cliff. Up on the cliff would be weird. There's not a lot of room. Oh, it's red because of the earth tree burning. That makes sense. It's in the area above the Almanac village. Might be behind the barrier. Well, I thought I needed to kill the dragon. But it's getting, this quest is getting weird and circular. Game's hard. This game's nonsense without the wiki. Ah, not... 
He had a spare lantern for whatever reason. An astrologer's hood for astrology. Hope someone didn't try to summon me while I was in the shop. There should be a death bird out here somewhere at nighttime. We can try to find them. The adventure wasn't a total waste. These nighttime bosses are so weird. What are the odds of you ever finding them? Is that him or is that just a shadow and I need better glasses? What the fuck is that? Giant head. I think it's one of those cannon things we saw. The sun's coming up. We might be on track to miss the death bird again. Could quite possibly be our last trip to the swamp. be deep root depths. I don't know why everyone's got a boner for deep root depths tonight, but don't be deep root depths. Don't be the dragon. Sorry, there's there's quite a few things I don't like fighting. Um, I can't help you fight Malekith, but I will help you fight Malekith. I'm just going to provide zero functional assistance when we get there. It's quite a walk, though. This place had way too many bonfires. This place just kept going. After you. This way, guys. Hey, they don't fucking care. It took me like 10 minutes to find that door. I'm lost already. I'm like a kid at the mall. Did they go back up the stairs? Did he fall off the fucking cliff? What the hell possibly could have got that guy? I'll just... Uh, there might be a, a phantom on my ass. Made by Bloody Finger 1v1 me. Are you in for a surprise? What a fucking... Just some of the PvP concepts in this game. It's like walking onto a football field. I demand someone play basketball with me. That's not the rule. We gotta get going, man. Just run by the Crucible Knight. 
If he does not know to run by the Crucible Knight, this is a really bad spot to get invaded. He's already killed the Crucible Knight. Uh, just go. I fucking hated this section. In what fucking fantasy land do you think I'm going down the lightning hallway? He's right at the top of the ladder. I don't know why the fuck I keep though. No. Maybe I can do this. Yeah, that spell doesn't hurt, obviously, but this thing doesn't fuck around down there perpetually. Damn, this weapon's red always thinks another bloody finger sneaking up on us. I really don't want to go down there, though, because the light... Oh, boy. What are you doing, homie? The eagle's alone here. over. Fucking. There's literally a mechanic where people will be invaded on demand to help fight the invader. The hunter stuff. It's a 1v1 me. No. Go to the Coliseum. This guy's having a hell of an easy time on the run since he has a ranged attack. this jump in time? I'll scare him off. Man, got invaded. I'm like my least favorite part of the whole zone. He's doing just dandy. What the hell am I doing with my build? I mean, I could have wore a crossbow. I have the Earth Tree bow. I'm just a stubborn person. I forget all the buttons I'm allowed to press. Oh, fuck, you fight some. You got it.
This part will be a little tricky. I'm gonna do this. I'm just gonna run in and probably give my life. to see what I'm doing. There we go. Hammer to hammer communication. All right, we're almost out of here. He never got his sentinel, and uh, if he goes for it, I'm not gonna have anything to help him fight Malekith, but we were able to help this guy get through the zone. Did I get enough for a level? I got enough for a level, so just one more level in decks after this. You're, you, really, you think we're going to be able to two-man this? I am dog shit these late game bosses, homie. Oh, no, he did get a summon. Wizard. We might be fine on the boss if we got a wizard on this. The host might be fine on the boss with a wizard helping him. Just a little extra reach there. Alright, I have a single flask. It's completely up to Harry Potter here. That's what I don't like about getting summoned into the zone, too, is you get so few flasks. If they summon you at the beginning of the zone and you get them all the way to the boss, you get, like, one flask left. It's all dumb physical shit we can't block anyways. Later. Ah! Alright, Harry Potter was not having a good go there either. No blue cat, I'll tell you that. Shouldn't where's patches after he got kicked out of Volcano Manor? You know what? I think I found a book and never gave it to uh, anybody. Luckily, this is who we give books to. I'm going to level up first. One more level on that Blasphemy Blade. Greetings. Got a book. Oh, what have we here? It's an ancient Very dragon well, prayer book. Let us both learn together. Heresy is not native to the world. It is but a contrivance. All things can be conjoined. Uh. 
study these incantations. All right, what do you got for me? Massive heal. Golden ring of light to attack a wide area. Takes intelligence. Lame. Heals all elements. Lame. Faith 32 for a lightning spear. 26 for this one. Are you giving me Elden Ring advice with text, speech to text? Are you for real? Counselor E.G. I wonder if he has anything to say about the fact that I work for Rainy. Rainy, Ronnie. These masterful different names. Hello. Oh, there you are. Good of you to drop by. Have you heard? Lady Rani has departed on her journey along the dark path of Empyrean from Rena's rise, as she calls it. It would not have been possible without you. As Lady Rani's war counselor and, moreover, her childhood warden, I express my deepest gratitude. You and only you were Lady Rani's true champion. Okay. Lowers FP consumed by skills. Sorcerer Thaps, Nomadic Merchant. All right, well, we're just trying to get our last level worth of summons. If we were impatient, we could maybe eat the remembrances, but let's not do that. I bought it, right? Did I buy the Sword of Blasphemy? Yeah, there's the bow right there that I should use instead of pouting when uh, I can't hit things. There it is. The list of places I don't want to be summoned to is growing, but we're being summoned to another world as a cooperator. Yeah, I fucking hate Fire Giant. I think he might resist strike. Which isn't helping me, but... Actually, you know, another weapon we can level up. Is this guy, which takes 18. Fuck, never mind. I don't want to... I don't want to get that much more decks, but this one's kind of fun, I guess. Not quite the whirly gig, but it's got some bleed on it too for a colossal. It's also several pounds lighter. Did you get invaded? We could try that too, except I don't really have anything I can power stance with. 
Oh, no, no, these are shit. Um, you know what, actually, if I got these, if I got these both to plus 24. Hang on, this weighs 26. These weigh 10. That could work. That's just stupid enough to waste time trying it. Luckily, I have uh, I have tomorrow off, so if we can't beat Elden Ring tonight, we'll stream it tomorrow to wrap it up. But I really want to get Elden Ring finished this week, so I don't lose my train of thought over Easter weekend. Because I'm fucking forgetful enough when I play the game hey. on schedule. You're beautiful. He's okay. Hey. I'm not gonna hit on you. Just go through the gate. We are so fucked, by the way. Richard and Jack? I'm sorry I fucked up your combo of regular people names. I'm Michael. Michael Us. I think for maximum damage, you probably want to use the guts. Ultra Sword and then another giant Ultra Great Sword, but I for sure have those regular Great Swords. We can get those to plus 24 since we've unlocked that at the merchant. It's gonna be fucking expensive though. I just want to die, frankly, so let's see what this. Sounded like the summon bird to death. Not the bad fire, that's the bad fire. Ow. Oh man, just kept fucking backpedaling. You're on your own. Oh, fuck. I've never... I don't recall people making those noises when they cook off. Can you power stance the Blasphemous Blade? If it's the same weapon class, you can power stance it. Because it's not a button anymore. It's just if they're both the same weapon type, it's a new animation set. That really sucked because uh, we get no runes when they die on Fire Giant. I'm not even sure if I can get summoned when I'm in my inventory. I hope so. Because I want to see what colossal weapons we have to work with. Where's my chest? Nope, it just rips you out. Okay. Yeah, so power stance blasphemous. What 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 is the blasphemous sword? Is it a great sword or a colossal weapon? Because if it's a god damn it. If it's a colossal weapon, we could pair it with um You might even be able to pair it with the giant crusher, I'm not sure. Even though one's a hammer and one's a sword. It is, I have it, so we can just it's just a great sword. So you could wear it with a banish knight's great sword. And that would be considered power stancing. But for fashion purposes, you'd want the same weapon, right? You'd want it to be the same. If it isn't the Bronco Purvis. Scepter of the All Knowing. Oh, because we beat the shit out of that guy. Scepter in the form of a hand grasping a pearl. Signature weapon of Sir Gideon off near the all-knowing. The pearl stands for the world, the heavens, and an eye, representing the many forms of knowledge, never fully attainable. Even knowing that, the all-knowing's hand grasps for it. Raise the scepter to manifest the realm of the all-knowing. Enemy magic and holy damage negation will be reduced for all within the area, including the caster. 
And that's just a hammer made out of someone's fingernails. See, I think he's got the Guts Great Sword. People love that thing. I kind of regret not going for it, but the Giant Crusher was just too appealing to me. Yeah, I, I am not very good with this uh, setup, but I love the way it looks. I could have slotted all sorts of other shit in here, like Dragon Bot Breath if I really wanted to. Yeah, power stands. Great swords are just ran a great sword. Hell, I think I can use the Guts Great Sword. Let's just put all the Sonic Stones on that. Well, maybe not all, because we've only got the one at this time. Well, someone does damage. Oh, fucking double Electro Weave. feel like maybe I just didn't get what this boss was all about. I get summoned by someone else and we get the shit kicked out of us again. Fun boss. It wasn't even rolling, it just fell on me. Again, can't get in fucking room with something to fire. It's also a very loud boss. I'm gonna have to lower the audio of like the whole game when I go back over these. So we might be able to go, yeah, the guts greats are the blast on this planet.
Maybe it's not Colossal all. Maybe it's just a Greatsword. I thought it was an Ultra Greatsword or something. Yeah, a coarse iron lump of an Ultra Greatsword. It's it's a Colossal Sword. Oh, okay, so it has to be in this class. So I can use it with the Troll's Golden Sword, the Crafted Blade Greatsword, and the Ruins Greatsword. But I can't use it with the Blasphemous Blade. The Blasphemous Blade I would have to use with something like uh, Marius Execution Sword, which we're not going to use because that's uh, 23 Arcane. Knight's Greatsword. Gargoyle's Great Sword. Gargoyle's Black Blade, which takes faith. Knight's Great Sword. Well, uh, 114. Sorry, 141 plus 54. Oops. I actually think the Banished Knight's Great Sword is a little stronger in the end. It's got higher strength. Two, might be able to get two Blasphemous? No. I'd have to do some weird duping shit, I think. Oh, wait, no. Didn't someone say those... The walking mausoleums let you duplicate remembrances? You might be right. Yeah, the walking mausoleums. If we could get his, then yeah, we could get a second Blasphemous Blade. And then... Power stance that. How much how heavy is it? It's gotta be under twelve pounds. Thirteen, so no. We would gain weight doing that. Um this is going great by the way. I said I wanted to beat the fucking game. Much like the devil you're trying to seduce me. Um there was one in deep root depths. I really don't want to be rude to people and unsummon myself, but I also really don't want to do fucking Fire Giant. Ow. Ow. That's what I fucking hate about doing the heavy attack on a horde, is I just want to scrape it along, and then uh, sometimes it doesn't work out. Sometimes that happens. Well, one of you can hit me. Gee, not all it. I said one. I said fucking one. Of you. Not a strong opening. I wish that happened when I hit guys on a horse, let me tell you. Well, there's none on you. Uh-oh. Might be something else to make this guy fall down. Like, maybe I gotta get all the knights. Luckily, he also went to the fucking strip mall school of jousting and got a terrible education. Not a good time to get summoned. There we go. He's dead. Another flawless joust. <laughs> All right. Don't be fire giant. I fucking swear to God. Oh. 
Well, I got what I wished for. Yeah, fucking don't summon people on this one. It's not really a gun. There's the ballista, but we gave up on the ballista because it's too handed. And now I'm kind of afraid to put my sign down in case that guy stubbornly summons me again. There's a chance that this guy might just come down if we get all the goons. I gotta get through though. They got a fucking PhD in mounted combat for some I was jumping off too. Fuck off that knock me down. And I think they... Nope, okay, I got off the horse just in time. So he's technically not dead. to think of other mausoleums I forgot to check. I haven't used any of them, so I may have already activated a uh, Remembrance one. I gotta jump on you from the tree branch, don't I? Son of a bitch. Means I gotta get past Great Bow Gus here. Nothing magical about him. I got a bit of stagger. Oh, and it's filled with fucking basilisks too. Fucking death blade. 
might be. I think if I fuck up the jump, I'll fall. Certain mausoleums have specific boss souls. Jesus Christ, we'll want to look that up then. I'm going to go to the bathroom in a moment. That's probably the perfect time to look at... Ooh, no you don't. Holy fuck. It didn't need this many. It didn't need this many basilisks. It didn't need any basilisks. Got it. Hello, door? All the spooky shit's on. I'm guessing maybe the door won't open until we walk down. Come on now. Maybe I got enough? We're going on an adventure here. I feel we're on the ground now. Okay. Hey, I can just snag another one. It's, it's, no, not Fire Giant. Oh, shit. No, he's not here. It was, oh, who's Blasphemy Blade? Rickard? No, it'd be the Blasphemous. I'm an idiot. That's why I have nine intelligence. Yes, give me this one. then we got two blasphemy blades I'm a little concerned about the fire situation I'm sure it'll sort itself out which puts us further away from our uh hey now Why would you let me duplicate? It's like, oh, you can get both. Well, fucking, what if, just give me the goddamn weapon again. What a weird limitation. So we could go, well, this thing's actually really fucking heavy is the problem. Yeah, we could go this and then the Guts Great Sword. Yeah, that's a shame. I knew like a, like stuff like Giant Crusher I mean, you could, like, summon a dude, and then he drops his, I think. I gotta go to the bathroom. So let's do that. And then we still need to farm out uh, a level. We need to farm out one last level, and then we need to farm out enough runes to... afford to level up the Blasphemy Blade to 10. And then we have to pair it with another great sword. So let me find let me find a bonfire. Then we'll go to the bathroom. Uh, oh, you know what? I wanted to do this because there was something in here and I missed it. I want to say it was maybe an incantation. Oh, uh, we're kind of not near anything. I guess we could... Uh, I'd backpedal. I'd backpedal from this one. Yeah, there's more to that garrison. So 
So this is great. Yeah, so it's a great sword that we can pair with it. Do we have any nice great swords? We really don't. The Gargoyle's Black Blade intrigues me. It's got a little holy sprinkled into it. We'll take that. That takes Int. That takes Arcane. We're definitely not going to use that one. And then, well, uh, that, that would make us very fucking fat, actually, if we went Guts Greatsword and Trolls Greatsword. That'd be a lot of damage. Yeah, I'm not looking to go on any whimsical adventure to get new weapons. So I'm just trying to scavenge a little wacky shit of what we already have. Like, we could take... Um, like we could use like a dragon great claw with it if we wanted to or we could where we could fall back down to the great mace and then wear it with the great stars which gives us some bleed but double magma sword is another double uh, power stance we could do but uh, that dropper is dog shit. We didn't even get one, so. Okay, I'll go to the bathroom and we'll consider, we'll continue our rune farming adventures here. What's this I missed here? Try my luck with the optional region in Millennia, though. I'm... I think I'll struggle just to beat the fucking final boss, frankly. Tell you what I'll do. We're just gonna eat it if I can't fucking get the sword I want. Unless I could do something weird like take this into New Game Plus and then immediately turn it into the weapon I want, but then I'm stuck in New Game Plus and things are way more spongy. There we go. Got our 15 decks. We can finally use the Sword of Blasphemy. I would have liked one more in Endurance to round it out, but let's not get too autistic.
That's weird. They don't see. Oh wait, no. So it's it's the. There you go. You use the the left hand. Is the power stance move set. I was about to say, do the little hands on the sword move? And they do. Probably don't want to rest that on my shoulder. Get a little sticky. Yeah, I for sure want to use this sword so we can go all in on that, but I'm not sold on the gargoyle sword. He's just really starting to lose it. Tell me about yourself. He's got amnesia. Is the round table burning in ruins? Why does that girl weep for me? Oh. Have I forgotten something of dire importance? I wouldn't worry about it, homeboy. They both take somber, so we can get. Okay. I'm fucking flat broke. Let's eat another boss soul. do a lot of damage honestly I think I'd rather just get a lot of strength I'd rather go a uh, banish night grave sword for the other one I think I mean it's half the weight and much lower stat requirements than the giant crusher but That's weird. This one has a fanciful sheath. Who are you? Oh, no. I need 12 of everything. That's probably fine. Hey, that's that uh, wizard spell he's using. I'm gonna run out of money. Jesus Christ. Not even close. Well, that's gonna be fun. What are my stats here? I think I I can't be Meatball of Justice still. I actually can be Meatball of Justice. Actually, hang on. Can I be light if I take my clothes off? No, I have to. I can be Meatball of Justice though. Rolling, rolling towards freedom. But now I have no more, no more souls. I 
I think the problem though is because I'm dual wielding it, I don't use a special attack on it. I use a special attack on my other weapon. I could maybe hold them the other way. I'm not sure if your dominant arm. I'm not sure if the right arm gives more attack power than the left. Nope, nope, I can. I can do that one with two hand, okay. My damage output is actually going to be really low because this great sword in my offhand has no levels in it. Let's try to explore that garrison. We'll just worry about all the danger ones for inside. Greatsword has nothing on it. Switch it to heavy, bump it up to a plus 24. That'll hopefully give us a lot of damage. Coastal Cave. I can actually sacrifice this fucking equip load one finally for poise. Where is it? I don't know what we're fighting. I don't remember this place. What the fuck is that? Oh, I think it's my Blasphemous Blade here on me. How are we already at the boss? What is this place? Demi-humans. This guy must just be doing some cleanup on the map. Take that, low-level guy. Oh, we got a bubbler. That's something else. <laughs> Make sure sometimes it's out of tune when he does the bubble attack. Of course, sir. Whatever you say, Mr. Miyazaki. He's actually uh, not that good. Let's wait. Let's wait until we get the Spanish Knight's Greatsword leveled up. Let's just hold it with both hands, and in the meantime. Yeah, I remember we explored this place briefly, but I think I missed some stuff. Like how to get up there. How would you? This ladder. Solved the mystery. I have really high points, all right? Let's see how much life that gives us. Tiny bit. Can't get too crazy. Actually, you know what? She likes fucking fire. We'll give her some fire.
looked like a prayerful strike. I thought there was something here I missed. Maybe I did grab it. That's ominous. Just having a little prey. damage. Careful Strike also had a lot of poise. I'm still a little annoyed that just like fire burns my poise. Magic fire is okay, but even just like a stick on fire really fucking hurts for some reason. I can mimic him here and I might as well. He can medium roll, he's got both swords. Show me what you're thinking. First thing he does when he's born is eat some crab meat. Why would he eat two crab meat, though? He must be really hungry. Is that me or is that you? Staff of the guilty, if you say so. Yeah, just watch out, other me. It's over here where we got fucked. Go get her, other me. One add monster. It's a trouser snake shield. Is that all you're up to here? Was there other stuff? There was other stuff. Holy shit, you scared me. They're called ladders. The Giant's Prayer Book. And that's where the bonfire is. Um, I dropped my runes down there and I forgot to pick them up. Whee! 
Man, that that'd be an unfortunate view right before you die. Just up my skirt as I slide down the ladder. Ooh. Beautiful legs, though. Give that to Myrtle the Turtle. Muriel, but that doesn't rhyme, so. Well, we accomplished fuck all today. <laughs> Didn't fight a single of the last game bosses. Greetings. Hello, I have a book I found. Can you read Giant? Oh, what have we here? Very well, let us both learn together. Heresy is not native to the world. It is but a contrivance. All things can be conjoined. Hurls massive ball of raging fire. Hurls several balls of fire at once. Charging enhances potency. Neat. Oh, fuck off. Just let me summon. It's fine that you can't summon people in, but let me put mine down. What if I wear two of them? Do I get two sheaths? Yes, I do. Very stylish. Unfortunately, I'm sure the Blasphemy Blade is stronger. Actually, with 60 strength, Heavy might win. These get quite expensive. Where can I go chill out? Fight me, you coward! How do you like it? How do you like it when I just fucking leave? He teleported away, that's my thing. Oh boy, if it isn't my old friend nobody. Oh Christ, is this Godskin Duo? This is Godskin Duo. Fucking weeb's gonna fight the godskin duo with a twin blade. Show off. Actually, what am I doing? We just gotta get used to the new weapon.
just want to go to sleep. Real class and boss. Let's get us some rooms. Tons of fun, great boss. A rune arc for my trouble at least. Buy some more smithing stones. Alright. Oh, I was fighting this guy. Fuck you. It's quicker. It's definitely quicker than the Giant Crusher. And I guess some of these bosses, it's a hit I'm going to land and not get hit uh, compared to Giant Crusher where, like, if you watch me fight the Fire Giant, I get one hit off, and then if I try to attack a second time, he just fucking steps on me. But a Blasphemous Blade might get two attacks off. I wonder if you could do something really greasy, like put go uh, double banished greatsword and then put bleed on both. Have you lost your memory? I see. Yeah. Oh, so it wasn't just me this happened to. To think he'd forget who you were as well. I knew he'd burn himself out. Old Hugh. I think we could talk him into leaving the round table hold now, but maybe it's better that we don't. It's only proper that we respect his choice to stay. I don't know if that's true. Damn it. Never tell these doors apart. Oh god, I actually can't afford the very last one. And then we still need to pay the smith himself. It's a shame he didn't forget that part. That'll be 7,000 runes. Oh no, you told me I should never pay for armament strengthener. Really? Yeah, yeah. You insisted. It was this big thing. That's the dire thing you forgot. One more juicy boss kill that'll give us enough to finish this crazy experiment. And then we can die to the final boss a couple times. Looks like we won't get it tonight, but like I said, I should have some time tomorrow to play. Just throw ourselves at the final boss. Well, final boss is. We're not. We're not. We're not at the very, very end, but we're very close. the sword easier on horseback? Seems a very similar move set. Fuck. I, I said fuck you. Are you deaf? He 
He's red. That's not good. Don't remember the last time I fought a red. Red is just... Um, tough for no good reason. Doesn't even get more loot. Oh, it's just a flask. I remember there were a bunch of flask beetles out in the mountain that tricked me. Fuck you. Is that a campfire or one of those phantom trees? Phantom tree. Well, I'm going to forget about that guy and get shot in the throat when I come back. Like that guy that scared the hell out of me outside Lindell today. Jesus Christ, that fucking guy. <laughs> D's butts, baby. Hey. You're a disgrace to the meep. Man, never mind. I take it back. Hey. Fucking mad respect hey. for summoning as many meatballs as you could find. Let's go make some rigatoni, baby. Man, the different ways to play it, too. We've got two-handed hammer, double fist, and uh, sword and shield. Incredible. Oh, that was the vine. Man. Oh fuck. Because the little dagger's magical, it went through. Ah, we almost got him too. And I could have used that to finish the the sword. Uh maybe. Might need a boss from after him, like on the mountaintop. Well, I hope that guy was able to beat it. Team Meatball. Steel. What the fuck are you doing here at level 140? Hey! 
I guess he could have beat the game and then looked up all the shit he missed, because that's what I'm going to do. Hey. This weird millennia. Consecrated snowfield shit. Yeah, I'm like, eh. Blasphemous Blade, Banished Greatsword is kind of cool, but maybe, maybe the Guts Greatsword and the Troll Greatsword would have been a lot more damage. A lot more damage befitting my high strength build. I think I'd maybe respec out of the strength, uh, out of the faith if I did that. Just go baseline strength as an affront to God and see how much damage I can get. Probably up to like 70 or maybe even 80 strength if I did that. Eh, probably 70. Probably 70 I'd put the rest in endurance. Come here, you fucking nerds. She's up there singing. Get her! Oh, that's the same song as the Harpies. I'm sure you could watch a two-hour-long lore video explaining the connection. <laughs> Fuck it. Eat shit. You fucking knock me back with your bare hand and don't get staggered by the sword. A boss gave me the sword. It was a gift. That is to say, I stole it from his soul. Fuck it. Uh, some of the animations that hurt are just infuriating, like tall woman open hand slap. Another Mr. Moose. Is this a boss? Is that why you summon people to this section? Is our host just gone? Okay, good. Hope he doesn't run off to the fucking Eternal City, because I don't like that part. Actually, I can do it now with the Great Shield. I don't mind, now that I think about it. I hated it before I had the Great Shield. Oop. Based on the fact the guy keeps standing around here, maybe the moose is a boss. And I just never fought him. What the hell's up there? Looks like we are going to go fight the Gargoyle. Which is fine, I can fight the Gargoyle. Can you slay the fires? Yeah, I, I, I don't think I fought that boss. Though. Wait a second, was that the sound of us getting invaded? Or did you guys just piss off a jellyfish? They just pissed off a jellyfish. You can jump over. What did I tell you?
Oh, that guy's got the weird poop arm. Who's our host here? Javier Soto. Blasphemy before we leave? Oh, hey! Yeah, I mean, it's... It's a cool sword, but I maybe we'll just overcorrect and wear the guts great sword, which is huge, so it's gonna have the terrible animations again. Power stance with big weapons. If we did all strength, I'd believe that. It looks like I get healed just as long as I'm holding the blasphemous blood. Like I'm not even helping those guys. They're probably getting fucked. I'm going to stand here and talk about it some more. Guts Great Sword probably has better reach. Yeah, I wonder if it... Um, you know, I feel maybe like the damage would be on par with the Giant Crusher, but... I don't have any other Giant Hammers that I want to dual Power Stance with. Like, that's going to be another three decks. I don't really want to do that. Yeah. That'd be a fun experiment if I had runes to spare right now. I don't, but... Yeah, I'd go double banish greatsword and then blood affinity. And then uh, I guess put some points in arcane. Oh man, what a baller. Be stacked. Everyone have some crab meat. I mean, everyone drink the flask. Just get the fuck in there, have you? Yo, yeah, well, there wasn't a fog gate for him. This is his first time, Coraline. This is going to be interesting. Block of homies. We already lost Coral. Stuck in the poison, I bet. I'm getting greedy here on the second swing. Flip into the wall, homie. Isn't there another cargo we should be worried about? There it is. Thank you. 
not. We're not. I have no fucking damage. It's probably because he's a statue and I don't do strike anymore. Oh, I don't have any FP for it, I think. Is the problem. I mean, once you're down to the second gargoyle, I feel you're usually fine. That mine fire, you're fine. Thought he was staying until he was doing poison. I got some good soldiers for crucible lands out. Don't touch me with that armor. Just stay back. I mean, go Jesus, but take a fucking hey. shower. Yeah, I can smell you through the screen. Alright, back here before some marionette soldier notices and shoots me. I need to freshen my drink up. Blasphemous Blade, Underwhelming. You waited till I finished. Uh, I'll just grab the drink first, and then we can check the chest for the great swords. Pull out a couple great swords. I want guts and I want troll.
I mean, I can wear them right out of the gate because all they all they do is they're big. Um, if I can take stamp off of the guts one, will trolls roar instead? Trolls roar gives us more damage, I believe. And I think because they're not boss weapons, I can give them any affinity. Uh, that's some really ball of justice shit. Now, can I get down to medium? I doubt it. These swords are fucking gargantuan. No way. Hup, ho, whoop. Lighter than they look. Did I find Alexander in Crumbling Fair in Missoula? Alexander is probably stalled out in Volcano Manor because we never got down to the little uh, lava pool he was taking a bath in. We didn't finish his quest. Um, I can change it. Now, can we change the affinity? I, I don't have no skill, though. Lion's Claw, probably. Ooh. Now, could you Lion's Claw while power stancing? No, no, because I think the other one just... Uh, Heavy. Just, that's pretty quick. Probably not terrible to use Big Sword of Shield either. Well, Giant Crusher had, I think, like 80% damage negation. We still got chipped down using it was the problem. It has to be 100%. Yeah, the Guts Sword does have pretty good negation. Not all the way, though, is the problem. Let's see what these guys take to max out. I'm going to say this door. These are just smithing stones. Luckily, um, I'm going to immediately give up on our, uh, our plan. And instead, use all the smithing stones we already bought on the Guts Great Sword and see what it turns into. Definitely looks like it's going to have more reach than the Giant Crusher. No. Oh no, said I was I was I said I was going to make them both blood, didn't I? Ran out of money. Ran out of money before we ran out of stones. Incredible. Hang on. Hang on. 300 plus 300. Okay. I was about to say, you better not fucking beat out the giant crusher. But he gets pretty big. He's definitely like one-handed. 325 plus 360. We're already kicking the shit out of this one. Actually, not by much. I'm bad at math. I can't think of anything to fight in the overworld that I want to fight. Like, we could fight dragons and Caleb, but that sounds fucking like a nightmare. What is this? Physical three.
Let's try to turn these both into blood before we get summoned. And then someone can say after I die that you shouldn't put blood on a colossal weapon. But too late. Hundred and sixteen, eighty-three on the other hand. The theory is because we double attack, we can apply it quicker than you normally could on a colossal weapon. But it might be a fucking disaster. It might be better to just go raw heavy, which I'd believe because we have so much strength. Ooh, I'm going to regret not blocking this guy. Hey, homie. Donnie Jang. Now, can I take this off safely? No. Never dabbled in blood every time I try. It's a fucking disaster, but I'm going to keep trying. Because I like to pretend I can do everything with my incredibly two-dimensional build. It's like I do a quick uh, chop. Someone got staggered. He's gonna pop. Oh, get in there, homie. I need my stamina back. I have an R2 still, don't I? Fuck you! I think he got the hit, not me. Um, I don't know if blood actually went off there. Probably should have gone strength, but... Our first kill on a very outdated boss of our overpowered weapons. I've got a good feeling about this. He's got little swords. Of course, it's going to cost King's Ransom to upgrade both of these to plus 24. And the sad thing is we didn't need that dex if we've immediately given up. If we've immediately given up on the Blasphemy Blade, we didn't need that dex. Jesus, this thing hits pretty hard even with the blood. Whoop, never mind. That was that was quick. I, yeah, I wanted to see if uh, we're getting... Actually, that's probably... That's good if it's still doing a shitload of damage with bleed on it. Oh, I was actually looking forward to fighting the fire giant with this setup, but it's death bird. All right. I'll get fucking fried. You guys can join the fight anytime now, by the way.
really fucks up your stamina, so it's a good thing we've been leveling our endurance. Oh! <laughs> Casually back here. I didn't get stuck on this guy for very often, but I always die when I get summoned, so I'm guessing maybe one of my moves. Holy shit! I'm guessing one of the people I summoned just beat the fuck out of him for me. I don't think his giant neck should do that much damage when he slams it down. Hey, this guy's a little styling, he's fighting with the shield as his weapon. Maybe he's got no he doesn't have Shaguri as well, I'm getting it. Yeah, I don't think the lead going off reliably enough. That's it for me. I actually survived that. Oh, I jumped and the fire staggered me. Sounded like someone else was cooking off, too. No arcane to speak. Yeah, oh well. I never have the balls to run deck, so I've never been a bleed character. We tried very briefly in Dark Souls 2. I wanted to be a katana guy, but that build fucking imploded. Let's switch this back to double heavy. One fifty five plus seven. It actually barely gets more damage. At least at plus zero on the troll sword. That does a lot of damage. Yeah, it's mostly the gut sword when we hit people with this current setup. I don't even know what this is gonna cost. Twelve of each stone and then the smithing fee. And again, I'm not even sure who to lazily fight between summons to do it. We could maybe try to dupe a Remembrance and then eat it, because I think the Remembrance duping is free. And we don't want their weapons, so we can turn those into free souls for this playthrough. Time really got away from us, though. We don't even, I, I don't think we even have time to fight the, the bosses tonight. We've just been fucking around with leveling. Is it just you again? I don't know why you'd summon me if you're the exact same guy. Hey! Yeah, you did a dopey emo when I joined, didn't you? Is that Golden Land? There's no way to tell. Nope, mine's different. Yeah, we could Lion's Claw this guy, because Lion's Claw should apply just the Gut Sword. What's the benefit of Power Stance? I think if they're if the other weapon was better, it's not, so we're gonna do this. If if they're equal damage, you end up getting a little more DPS than just the strength bonus from two hand. Here. That can't be fucking thing. Fucked up the repost. Oh, 
We did it, especially me, I hope. I don't think Deathbird's worth that much. That was actually worth a decent amount, but... If we're not even going to dual wield for a couple minutes, we can take this off, which makes us really light. And we take that off, which gives us this. Flame Peak! Shit! This is... This is the one I wanted the double sword for. Uh, let me tell you, plus zero trolls golden heavy sword is not gonna fucking cut it. That'll just be our little secret. He doesn't know it's plus zero. I just look really badass posing on this rock. Please find another summon, though. The rock is very cold. Weeb armor with a claymore. Don't tell the emperor. Why not just two-hand till I level up Troll? Because in this particular instance, like this is 341 plus 383. This is 142 plus 92. I don't think we'll get that much damage by holding this two-handed. Will it update here? 816. Okay, it does. Yeah, so see, we do 725, and then our left hand is 234. Hey! We only gain 100. We, we, we get more, even now. Just the extra, because it's like... I didn't see the actual math, but I saw someone explain that. The two-handing really only gives bonus damage if you couldn't equip the weapon otherwise. I'm sure it's more expensive on my stamina, but Fire Giant's gonna fucking squish me anyway. Man, people love that weave armor. I can't even remember what's on my flask. It's been so long since I cared to change it.
Oh, I thought he was going for a step. It was a fun play. He doesn't, he doesn't resist the strike, but I think he's weak to slash, which is why the sword's a little better, supposedly. I might be misremembering when I read the wiki after I finally killed him. I don't know why the fucking host is all the way over there. Spawn doesn't come out nowhere. That was a thousand damage, I'd just take my chances. He'll get more hits on. Definitely my least favorite fight in the game, the Fire Giant. Uh, 
And specifically, because uh, we're not doing it to break up the monotony of adventuring, we're using it to farm runes. So getting some into Fire Giant really fucking sucks. I think I've only helped one person beat it. Guys, actually, I'm a coward. I need a shield. I hope he knows how to summon the boss. We're gonna waste of flasks. Hey, you're a bubble boy, a bugler. The weapon you get on Parkour Tower. I'm not going back to that tower if I don't have it. Hello? Oh, okay. No, don't tell me the fucking host died! Thank God. No, nope. wait. Oh, he had the thing on that makes him look like the host. Oh, he's tricking me to death. Only 10,000, shit. I specifically need a lot of rooms. I mean, yeah, I'm just determined to finish this. Well, actually, I'm not determined. If it goes another 30 minutes, I've got stuff to do. Then we'll have to call it and come back tomorrow. Academy Crystal Cave, a goth woman. What have I got myself into? 
Okay, don't fucking pretty dance for me, young lady. This might be... Oh, this would be the uh, crystal golems at the end. Oh, maybe the rot one. Which I think we can still handle. Holy fuck, did you clear the whole place and then come summon me? You sweetheart. Now this is how you host. Even the big one? Yeah, wow, this girl fucks. Yeah, it's definitely crystal, guys. Let me get my wizard smasher. What does this do? Stance, break, ease your strength up. Alright, that's fine. I think I, I might actually just strip the faith off. I can't decide. It's literally all I do with my faith is cast Golden Bound, even then I forget sometimes. Hey, you had a little hammer too. Mine's bigger. I 825 runes for that. That definitely felt like an 800 rune fight. I beat the shit out of them. My spear bounced off his shield. Maybe I should do it again. My spear bounced off his shield. Maybe I should do it again. How can I follow the Lord with no faith? Well, it's the path the Lord lays for me as a test, but yeah. I definitely did not leverage the fact that I have points of faith on this playthrough. A lot of people fighting the bird today. I'm actually gonna go with the hammer. If I was determined to like follow Wiki more, we would know which boss is weak to which. So if they're weak to strike, we use strike, and if they're weak to slash, we'd use slash. Yeah, hi, where's this fucking death bird? There it is. Bad luck on the guard cameras. Oh, fuck it, the fire knocks me up the guard counter too. Locked onto the head, which is Here goes 
the host. It's that black flame that gets you. Or maybe it's destined death, according to the Black Blade of Malekith. Never use weapon buffs and incantations. I tried to use Black Flame, but it lasts like seven seconds. I just can't, I can't get into that place I like cast and shit constantly. Just leveraged by the fact that I have like 13 mines, so I can't spare FP on throwaway shit. But yeah, I knew there were a lot more spells in this game and you can definitely make strength, faith, or just pure faith work, I'm sure. Just, I, I don't. I don't play these games that way. If I could travel back in time, I would have gone pure strength. But instead, we're stubbornly committed to staying strength faith till we finish the game. Academy of Royal Lucaria. What the fuck are you doing? Help PP Largo. That first one hasn't come down yet. Is there a way to turn that off? Um, I don't even think I need Golden Vow on her as the thing. Stop fucking throwing books at me. phase two now. You can't block that. It's a shame normally the second phase is a shit stone. Wow, he is uh, having a bad go of it. He had a bad go of it. He's dead. Yeah, we're going to have to wrap this up soon. Really got carried away just leveling up random shit for no good reason. I don't have any spare runes to quickly pull anything off. I could try to sell shit, but you normally don't sell stuff at Souls games. You don't get your money's worth. Ah, not everyone can. Like a rune arc is worth two hundred. I need stuff that's worth like a thousand. This is garbage.
Yeah, nothing of real value. Short of just cleaning out your chest. Weapon incantations, they just... I have Black Flame. We'll try Black Flame. We'll try Black Flame. I think it's one... Maybe it's specifically Black Flame is the problem. Like, maybe Lightning lasts a while, but I think Black Flame is a single hit. So it's like a shitty version of Royal Knight's Resolve. Because Royal Knight's Resolve, I think, will go through um, a Grease as well. Lightning... I can actually cast that. <laughs> oh right, I fucking don't do it because I put it in my weapon hand now. We never got the claw mark seal up to 24, but I don't think that's gonna fucking make or break the build either because even our hammer wasn't in the 20s for the longest time, so you'd be doing a good chunk of the game with just that. Whoops, that removes the enchantment. That's a fun... That's a fun oopsie. That does 909. That might be with the buff. Well, let's see. Wow, that actually adds a lot. You go from 790 to 909. What do you think I should go Sacred Blade? I guess we go Sacred Blade and make it heavy, right? Let's see what that does. 9-11, never forget. Ah, that's only 90. I'd rather buff it with the spell. Flame Peak? Well, we're going to see how much he likes fucking lightning. On the gut sword, though, because I think he does hate slash. Hey! Uh, hello. I don't want to do it because it's going to take valuable FP, but. Um, this is probably going to be our last run of the night, one way or the other. I would have liked to finish the troll great sword, hey! but. Oh, he's got the Blasphemy Blade himself. I would like to use the Blasphemy Sword. I'm just used to the big weapons now. Oh, well. There were no boss colossal weapons that caught my eye. I'm going to two-hand it. So we do 816 without the buff. Whoop! That barely added damage too, fuck. Oh no, wait. I haven't added a hundred. This, this run is not gonna go all the way. 
that's a terrible no tend on, but continues with the theme of me hitting this fight boss. The big one hit me. I couldn't see it. Is that the host? Yeah, I feel the music ducks out when the host is the one that dies. Oh, well. I'm going to call it a night here. I'm going to be at just dying to fire giant all night when I'm just trying to get some runes. We can't really buff both swords though, can we? When we're dual wielding. Because we'll only buff one. And then if you put it away, that doesn't count. Let's level up the troll grade sword. As far as we can get plus nine random. If I put my sign in a boss I'm confident in, I'm not confident in Godskin Duel duo, duo at all. It's just that one fight a guy threw sleep at it. And I would I'd hate I'd hate to farm Godskin Duo because you have to use sleep to beat him reliably. There's like the, I think there's a sleep spell and there's a sleep sword, but I don't use either of those. We're just going to call it and then tomorrow, hopefully, I don't want to go there because that runs like shit. Um, we'll go here. Tomorrow we can finish this sword off and then realize it was a terrible idea compared to the hammer and then beat the game. So what do we got here? Two-handed, this sword does 816. And then see, but if we power stance, it's 725 plus 394. So we should do more damage overall. Dual uh, power stance and great swords. Yeah, 725, and this will probably get close to 725 as it reaches 24. So that's going to be, yeah, potentially 1400 attack rating versus if we hold this with both hands, 911 considerably more never forget um, and then I think golden vow would passively apply to both no matter what I'm doing 725 394 yeah and then I bet you we can even do this Yeah. You got to really go, really got to go for it at that point. I think you have 30 seconds on Flame Grant Me Strength, so you got to capitalize on that. 1,500, and this sword's a piece of shit right now. So we might approach 2,000 attack rating with this, which could be interesting. But it'll take a bit, because we have to get some of the bosses we know we can kill. Yeah, what's a boss that I... I don't know. I feel I feel if you go near and far, you just get summoned more often. Whereas if I went to a boss I knew I could kill, I might get summoned like once every 20 minutes, which would be bad. But we effectively made zero progress on our own game, but we helped a few people kill some bosses. Uh, some people shouldn't have been stuck on the bosses they summoned us on, but 
could have been their first go, but regardless, there was a couple places that I was confused I got sucked into at level 140. But I'll see you next time with some more Elden Ring. Quite possibly the end of Elden Ring. Until then, thanks for watching.